In an interview with CNN, Foreign Minister Joseph Wu said that Taiwan needs to be fully prepared for a military conflict with Beijing. He said that China's expansionist ambitions have reached the South China Sea and the Indo-Pacific region. As Taiwan's decision makers, he said the Tsai administration cannot take any chances and must be prepared for China to attempt a forceful unification. Wu called on the international community to help maintain regional stability and continue to support Taiwan. CNN recently sat down with Foreign Minister Joseph Wu for an exclusive interview. Wu was asked about the options Taiwan has to counter Chinese aggression and whether reunification by force is likely. I think the Chinese are trying to unify Taiwan through peaceful means if possible, but they want to use force if necessary. So we need to prepare ourselves for a possible conflict. We hope it doesn't happen. A war between Taiwan and China is in nobody's interest. Wu said that aside from sending its war planes to intimidate Taiwan, the Chinese government continues to use the internet to sway Taiwanese public opinion. They use cyber warfare, they use cognitive warfare, disinformation campaign, and the military intimidation to create a lot of anxiety among the Taiwanese people. When the reporter asked why China would choose to increase its pressure on Taiwan at this point in time, this is how Wu responded. I think they are also trying to expand their sphere of influence over the East China Sea, over the South China Sea, or beyond the first island chain into the wide Pacific. So this is not just Taiwan's problem. And we certainly hope that the international community will continue to look at the peace and stability in this region with attention and continue to support Taiwan. Wu's outspoken defense of Taiwan has led him to be accused by Beijing of being a diehard separatist. Speaking to CNN, Wu said all he's done is speak the truth and that China cannot tolerate the truth. The foreign minister said that he was honored to be targeted by the Chinese government.